So here in the swamps of Texas, everything is trying to eat bugs here. So a lot of the insects here have some really good defenses for uh, hiding and defending themselves against a lot of the toothy creatures out here. So here's one of the best at it. This is a walking stick. You notice it looks so much like a real stick. You can, oh, 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 sorry. I got it, got it confused. This right here is a walking stick, specifically a two-striped walking stick. Now when I say that, there's actually two of them. You'll see a little male hitching a ride on top of that large female over there. That's why they're called a devil's riding horse because they're really usually found with the little male sort of riding on the female like that. Now you may think, huh, devil, that's sort of weird. They have a few other nicknames like the musk mare and the devil's darning needle. So they have all those really sinister names because of another defense. They're not just trying to look like a stick blending around. You'll notice these stripes uh, that sort of, you know, probably the main reason I found this guy. All right, let's tell, let's talk about his terrifying little defense as he's walking on me. So you notice the stripes, they're a lot more noticeable than would be in other walking sticks. Now what these guys use those stripes for is a warning. It's telling predators, do not mess with me. I'm packing something you don't want to find out. So these guys will actually shoot out a really noxious milky white fluid from two little holes right in front of their head right there. And they're deadly accurate with it. Uh, if you're a little kid picking one up, it can aim directly into your eyes from about one and a half feet away and then the range will slowly decrease from there. Now this fluid, if it gets in your eyes or your nose, it's gonna burn your eyes just really hurt your mucous membranes in your nose. That's why I'm wearing these sunglasses because if this gets in my eyes, I'm gonna have about five days where I'm not gonna be able to open them whatsoever. Every time I see light in any way, it's gonna blind me and hurt like crazy. The swelling in the eyes is terrible. The pain is excruciating. So if you're ever sprayed by these guys, you need to wash that out with water. Uh, it's gonna soothe the pain, but your eye is still gonna be compromised for almost a week. These guys are, and it looks just like a normal bug. You know, kids may be playing out here, pick it up, show it to their parents. You know what, when I first came to Texas, I actually saw a few of these guys and were picking them up. I had no idea about that defense. So I'm not trying to plug myself too hard right now, but people really need to watch programs like this or just educate themselves on creatures like this because little kids or even stupid frat guys like me might pick up a bug, not realize that could be very, very dangerous. So watch out for these little guys when you're in the forest. Be educated about animals like this and you may save yourself a lot of pain. Awesome, the devil's riding horse.